morning. Stand man. Good morning. Good morning, Miss Emma. Good morning. How are you? Where are you going? Where are you going? My floors are filthy. And you. Hello, Oliver. Oh, there's your brother. Hello. Just all the animals. Do you want to go outside? Let's go outside. Let me get my shoes on. Ooh. I'm throwing my shoes. Let's go outside. That's not the grass. Come on. Come on. There's nothing in the grave. You gonna go on the grass? Oh goodness, y'all. Look at my tomatoes, they're coming. I have like all the tomatoes and my cherry tomatoes. They are happening. I'm so excited. My greens, that was spinach over there, but it did not work out for me. My parsley is just happening. Cilantro is not happening, but I got kale. I got lots of kale and basil and green onions and chives. And then I planted these hot peppers, but they're not really doing anything yet. But I'm gonna have tomatoes, that's for sure. little guys. You don't want to pee on camera, do you? Emma. Poopers. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll take you off camera so you can go potty. You good? Well, hi guys. <laughs> um, it's been a while. Emma, Emma, go lay down. She thinks I'm leaving, and I am soon. But she's actually coming, so she's a little angry for nothing. Anyway. It has been quite a few months since y'all have seen me and things have been wild. I kind of took some time to evaluate myself and figure out why I was falling apart. I mean, I lost 21 pounds, went vegan, still vegan by the way, still here, still vegan. <laughs> I feel like that's something you have to say nowadays. Um, and I'm very happy I went vegan, but my weight loss kind of stopped because I stopped really eating clean. I kind of strayed and ate. I'm, I haven't been eating horribly, but I've been eating more junk food than I should. Um, so I was traveling a lot the last few months. I went to the Dominican Republic and spent some time with a friend down there. And then I went on a trip to Saskatchewan for, um, for some volunteer work. And then I just got back from Spain, which was 
the greatest trip ever, but I am still jet lagged. It's not been quite a week yet. So yeah, it's been pretty, um, pretty roller coaster like. It's now August. That's crazy because I don't think I've talked to you guys since like February, which is really pathetic. So I kind of asked myself why that is. Kind of took some time to think about what happened. And I think it's that I got frustrated because I lost 20 pounds, 21 pounds to be exact. But it didn't really, I didn't look different to myself. I couldn't, I didn't look in the mirror and feel different. And the scale had changed, but it was annoying me that I didn't feel like I could see it. So I let that frustration take over. Now, thankfully, I didn't completely ruin what I had already done because I thought I would. I just weighed myself to start the new month and I am exactly the same weight as I was when I finished. So I'm still down 21 pounds. That is a miracle in itself because I just got back from a trip where they had the greatest vegan restaurants ever in Spain and I had amazing food. That was usually pretty healthy, but not always the healthiest. There was also a vegan bakery that I fell into and had some cake slices, so there was that. But I guess I've been able to maintain what I did, so that's good. I didn't completely fall off the wagon, but I have not been eating in a way that makes me feel great. I've got a bunch of breakouts on my chin right now, which... I've got covered with makeup, but they are there. I'm sure you will see them soon. So that tells me that I haven't been eating very clean because I'm breaking out again, which I wasn't doing much of when I was eating really clean. So I need to reset and really focus on eating whole foods, not processed vegan foods like I love me some Gardein chicken, but I cannot eat that all the time. Oliver, he's so cute. He's trying to lose weight too. Side note. Anyway, so I'm going to do my best to get my life together and get back on track. Um, I just have to figure out the best way to do that. I'm considering doing Hannah's Lean and Clean plan, High Carb Hannah on YouTube. Um, I think that's probably the easiest way to get back into things. But I'm gonna give myself a few days to kinda get back on the continent and get settled in and I will start posting again and we will we will figure this out together. But I am so thankful I did not ruin the progress I had made because that would have made me feel even more frustrated with myself than I already am. Because I'm frustrated that I wasted a few months of my life and didn't keep working on myself. But say la vie, nothing I can do now. We just gotta move on. So, you ready to move on with me? I hope so. And let me know if you guys have been struggling. You know, new year, you get all excited and you work really hard on yourself and then all of a sudden you fall apart. Anyone else in that club? Or just me? I don't know. So, I will talk to you guys very soon. Um, I still have that shepherd's pie video that I haven't uploaded for you. It's recorded. I just have to get on that so I could upload that this week. And we will... You hear that? That is the sound of needy. Emma, I promise I'll be with you in a moment. So... 
I gotta go. I have to go do a makeup trial and, you know, some running around. So I will talk to you guys in the next video, which will come soon. I'll promise. We're just gonna ignore that sound over there. Uh, I love you guys. I miss you guys. And see you in the next one. Bye.